All right, good Thursday morning, everybody. We've had a few cold starts this week, but today, not so much. We are on the mild side out there right now, starting off in the mid-40s over the MSU campus there in East Lansing, dealing with mostly cloudy skies right now. I think we start to lose this cloud cover as we move through the morning here. Now, elsewhere across mid-Michigan right now, everybody in the mid-40s. We're at 46 in Jackson and Mason, 45 in Lansing, 44 in Elma. A little bit cooler for our southern counties, though. Uh, Hillsdale right now is at 39 degrees. The forecast for today, temperature-wise, it is a nice one. Highs getting into the low 60s, partly sunny skies through the day. Just going to be blustery. We're going to see winds out of the southwest gusting towards 45 miles per hour. That southwest wind is what's going to usher in that warmer air. Now the satellite and the radar right now does show kind of this extensive swath of cloud cover overhead. But these are primarily high clouds. So we're going to see, I think, filtered sunshine this morning before we do start to lose that uh, cloud cover over uh, ahead. Now look, zooming out here, you can see our setup. We do have high pressure down to the south, area of low pressure to the northwest. With Michigan between systems, we're going to see these windy conditions today and through much of the day tomorrow as well. This cold front is going to move through tomorrow as well, but I don't think we see anything in the way of precipitation, just some increased cloud cover. Now, today's high temperatures, this was supposed to be yesterday, so it was supposed to show that we got into the mid 40s and it was much warmer out to the west, and that warmer air out to the west is coming this way for today. Looking at the future track forecast today, we are going to see our temperatures jumping up fairly quickly here. By around noontime, we'll be in the upper 50s. Lots of sunshine out there. Again, we're going to climb into the low 60s by the afternoon. We'll see kind of a mix of sun and clouds through the day. Overnight tonight will be partly cloudy, and it is going to be a very mild one once again. Our lows tonight only dropping down into the upper 40s. Tomorrow starting off in the upper 40s, we should be in the mid 40s for our high temperatures this time of the year. And we're starting out above that tomorrow. And then tomorrow we see our high temperatures climbing into the upper 50s. That front does drop through. You can't hardly even see any impacts here. I think we do see uh, just some increased low cloud cover as that front does move through from the north to south. And then behind that much cooler air does arrive in time for us as we head into the weekend. Now wind gusts right now we are gusting towards that 20 to 30 mile per hour range. And as we move through the day here again, winds out of the southwest ushering in that warmer air. And this specific model is showing winds gusting to 40 to 50 miles per hour. I think it's overdoing it a little bit, but nonetheless, it is going to be a very gusty day across the region. Winds staying blustery overnight. I think we do gradually see our winds slacking throughout the day tomorrow. Uh, with gusts getting into that 20 to 30 mile per hour range eventually. Now we do have wind advisories in effect from 10 a.m. this morning until 5 p.m. All of our counties, again, anticipating winds to gust into that 40 to 45 mile per hour range. Now the next three days, well, the first two days staying pretty warm. 61 today, 59 tomorrow, both days on the breezy side. By the weekend, though, behind that front, cooler air our highs in the mid 40s. Now we are tracking kind of a sloppy system for us as we head into Saturday night, a mix of rain and snow temps in the 40s. Starting out next week, sunny skies on Monday, a high of 41 Then looking at another storm potentially for Tuesday night into Wednesday.